guys, Sylvia here. Today I have a fall winter haul from one of my favorite online stores, Princess Polly. And of course, what friend would I be if I didn't provide you guys with a discount code to my favorite store? You guys can use Sylvia for 20% off of everything site-wide. One of the reasons why I love it is because they ship so fast. You get free express shipping, which is three to four days within the US on all orders over $50 USD. Also, if you're in the US, they offer afterpay, so you can shop now and pay later. I'm really excited to add these items into my fall and winter wardrobe because my wardrobe needed a major refreshing. Their Black Friday sale is actually happening right now, so you better check that out. First off, I want to talk about this top that I'm wearing. I actually bought it as a whole sweatsuit set, and I am just a walking sky slash cloud. You guys actually might remember from my Princess Polly summer haul, I got basically the same sweatsuit but in a summer version, so it's a cropped sweater and uh, shorts. I loved it so much that I wanted a version to wear in the winter as well. And sweatsuits are like the number one go-to outfit right now because of COVID. But we still gotta look cute and we still gotta be feeling ourselves. So COVID, I have one thing to thank for you is to make sweatsuits the it item because I am all about it. Okay, so on a totally opposite scale, I actually picked up this really cute dress. It's leopard print, it has some frills and details on the front here, and it has these tied shoulders that allow you to adjust how high or how low you'd want it to be. And you guys might be thinking, why the hell are you buying a dress when the snow is going to be coming down soon? But I am a believer in cute dresses that you can wear in the winter with tights and like knee-high boots. And because I typically wear black tights, I go for dresses that have black detailing to them so it looks obviously like cohesive all together. You can also wear a black turtleneck under this that's so covering your arms, or you could put a sweater on top of it and just letting the dress peek through as like a little skirt. Weirdly enough, I've actually been super into denim lately and if you guys are longtime followers of mine, I was avidly against jeans. Like I just did not find jeans comfortable. I never, never wore jeans, never catch me slipping in jeans. But recently I have admittedly been exploring a lot of denims and finding comfortable denims, especially now that more baggy denims are coming into style and high waist because when it was about that low rise and the skinnies, I, I just wasn't down. I didn't feel comfortable at all. I picked up a pair of super baggy jeans that are like cargo jeans and it's funny because like back in the day cargo pants are just like so dorky I remember being in middle school or high school and being like boys with cargo pants ew but look at me now I'm a cargo pant wearer and it's especially great when it's baggy so you can like layer underneath I usually just layer like a thicker pair of fleece tights or something under my denim when I wear them in the winter so because we're doing so much lounging around at home I want to pick up something cute for that as well I'm all about matching sets and I got this knitted Top, crop top and shorts combo so I could wear this around the house obviously I wouldn't be wearing this out in the winter or I don't know if I'd be wearing this out at all it's like pretty crocheted and see-through-ish they're high-waisted shorts so comfortable and the crop top is nice and stretchy and comfortable with some bell sleeves down here I feel like the colors remind me of like a mocha latte or like a hot chocolate with marshmallows on top I don't know it just feels and looks very cozy to me Last but not least, I copped myself another sweatsuit and it is green! So I basically want to look like a string bean or a Malona bar because that's pretty much what this color is. It looks brighter on camera, but it's actually like slightly pastel, not super pastel, but not as bright as it looks in camera. And there's a little drawstring here so I could um, wear it tighter or I could wear it looser like a cropped top. I like the zip up here. I think it's just a nice cute feature. It's like that vintage looking feature like a dad sweater. And then the sweatpants that go with it have an elastic bottom so it's uh, more of that like baggy look. The inside of this one is so soft. I also realized that I kind of look like a Teletubby, but I'm not mad about it. I love sweatsuits that you can kind of still like stand out in because I'd be at the grocery store, but I still be standing out and looking good <laughs> in my sweatsuits. Honestly guys, send me more links for sweatsuits because I'm a sweatsuit collector now. I'm also a sweatsuit model if anyone's hiring. That's all I have for you guys today. I'm so excited to add these into my wardrobe and get comfortable and look cute. I hope you guys enjoyed this. Don't forget Sylvia for 20% off. For you. Give me a thumbs up if you like sweatsuits too. And I'll talk to you guys in the next video. Bye.